to a brief tutorial on downloading and installing R. R is a highly sophisticated statistical package that is free and open source. The first step in obtaining R is to go to the CRAN website, home site for all things R. To go to this website, go to your address bar, type in C R A N dot R dash project dot O R G. Press enter and it will take you to the website. To obtain R, select your operating system, Linux, Mac OS X, or Windows, and click on the appropriate link. Then on the next page, you want to download from the base, binaries for the base distribution. Click on this link, and it'll take you to another page. You can download the XE uh, main program file directly, or if you want to save stress on the main CRAN site, use a mirror site. We'll be using a mirror site. So click on mirror near you. I'll be using the USA site from Berkeley University. Click on that link. Unfortunately, it takes you back to the main uh, web page or the mirror of the main web page, but we can quickly get back to the download area. Okay. When you're ready, click on the installation XE. Save the file wherever you would like to on your computer. I've already downloaded it once, but for demonstration purposes, I'll be downloading it again. I'm good, not going to make you sit through the entire download, so I'm going to pause this screencast. Once the file has finished downloading, you'll need to go to the area on your computer where you downloaded it. In my case, that is the downloads file, downloads directory. Then you should see a new program installed, which is the R installation program. Double click on the program. And you, for most users, accepting to the defaults will be all that you need to do. You can choose the language for installation. It has several languages available. Uh, I'll be using English. So simply click on OK. You'll then see the installation wizard screen. Click on Next. You'll see the, the new general public license uh, under which the software has been released. You can read through it if you want. Click Next to continue with installation. I'll be accepting the default installation uh, default installation area. Click on Next. and you'll see that the components being installed. Uh, I also like to have the PDF reference manual with my installation, so I'm going to click on that to have it included. Click Next, Continue. I'll be accepting the defaults for the installation, so I click Next. This screen puts an R icon on your main page as well as in your Start uh, button using Windows. Click Next. I'm accepting the defaults. And it's installing. It installs fairly quickly, but again, I'm not going to make you sit through the entire installation, so I'm going to pause. Once the installation is finished, you only have to click the Finish button, and you'll be finished with the installation. Okay. And as you can see, there is an icon or R. Start R up for the first time. Double click on this icon. The R console will appear. After a few seconds you'll have information about R version and R installation that you've uh, put on your computer. To quit, you can either click on File, 
can click exit or if you prefer to use the console method Q open parentheses close parentheses and then enter save workspace image that's for a later tutorial so I'll click on no I hope that this tutorial has been helpful and I hope that you have a good day this tutorial is released under Creative Commons Attribution Share Alike 2.5 license.